President Donald Trump's presidential campaign is set to reach the Mexican border. During his term, the migrant crisis, especially through the Mexican border, became a key issue. Now, as he aims for another White House term, experts believe Trump will stress on his hardline immigration policies. Trump will visit the Texas-Mexico border on Sunday with Governor Greg Abbott. Abbott himself advocates tough immigration measures. Recently, the state of Texas passed a legislature which will make entry into the state without papers a crime. If violated, it can award the person two years in jail or up to 20 years if the person refuses to leave the United States. In his campaigns, Trump has vowed to bring in tougher crackdown on illegal migration. Reports claim his plans may involve detention camps and mass deportations. Trump and Abbott blame President Joe Biden for the current migrant crisis. Texas is considered as a reliable conservative base for Donald Trump. In Fort Dodge, Iowa, Trump celebrated a court victory after a judge allowed him to remain on the ballot in Colorado's 2024 election. Appearing at a rally in Iowa, Trump called the ruling a gigantic win. Today, the radical left Democrats and their allies in the fake news media, right back there, all those people with the camera. Are having an absolute meltdown because last night our campaign won a gigantic court victory in Colorado. <laughs> we had a very radical left judge, and uh, the radical left judge was saying a lot of things that weren't nice. And uh, in the end, uh, she saw the light. She saw the light and did what was supposed to have been done, and we won, and we demolished their de and defeated. You know, they had an outrageous attempt. Meanwhile, the frontrunner for the Republican presidential nomination said he will kill off an Asian trade pact tabled by U.S. President Joe Biden.